All right, quiet on the set. <laughs> Hi everybody, Robert Jones back with Installer Parts. Today I'm gonna to show you how to install the DVD wall mount shelving unit. This one we're going to do today has two shelves, but it's also available in a one shelf and three shelf unit. The pieces in the box may seem a little daunting, but this installation goes lickety split. All right, let's get started and let me show you how to do this. For this install, you're going to need a power drill, a 3 16 or 4.5 millimeter drill bit, a metric socket wrench, some blue tape, a tape measure, a Phillips screwdriver, medium to large and preferably with a long handle, a pencil, a stud finder, a level is not required but it can certainly make your TV look better. Be sure to have all these tools gathered and at the ready before you start the installation to ensure your success. Hi, we're over here at the wall. We're going to install this two shelf DVD player. Now, the installation is exactly the same for the one shelf or the three shelf. We chose the middle of the road with two. So. This is the rail that is going to go against our wall. This is the approximate location we're going to have here. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to use your stud finder. You're going to figure out where the wooden installation studs are. Ours are here. Now, this is for a wooden installation. If you are doing masonry or brick, please check out the instructions for more information. Once you've determined where the middle of your stud is, you can then hold up your rail and mark it. I've marked mine with this red pen. I've got the little circles here. Be sure to use a level to get yours perpendicular. Okay guys, for this part you're going to need a 5 30 seconds or 4 millimeter drill. We're going to go 2 inches deep. Just simply put the drill where you marked your holes. And there you go, 4 holes. Okay, once you've got your holes drilled, you simply put up the plate and we're just gonna do a little hand installation of the screw to get it started. And then we'll use our drill. I'm not getting it quite tight because I wanna get the other screws in there first and make sure it's perpendicular. Now, I just wanna make sure this is exactly where I want it to be and then tighten it down. Perfect, look at that, nice and solid. Next comes the cable management system that comes with the kit. So you're gonna use this piece and you're gonna put it on the bottom here. It slides up the rail and then snaps in place. Like that. Then take these and with the bumps facing the back, you'll see there's a little track to slide them down. Just like that. And one on that side, one more on that side, and one more on this side. In the box, you're going to find two of these uh, boomerang shaped items. These are the actual shelves that are going to be installed here. The first thing to do is to push a screw up through the small hole and then put the Allen wrench into it. The Allen wrench is included. Once you have the screw through the small hole, place the plate over the top of it and using the Allen wrench, then we're going to do the same thing with a second screw. If you do this on a table, it's probably a little bit easier. Okay, you can see that the plate is attached with both screws. Now, with the rubber feet facing up, slide the metal plate into the channel. Slide it down to the position you want, and then using the Allen wrench, tighten it. I'm gonna put ours at the bottom for maximum size. Next, take one of the glass plates and place it on top, lining up the hole at the back here with the hole in the back here. Inside the kit, you'll see that there's a small screw and also a small rubber washer. Place the washer onto the screw and then into the hole. Use the Allen wrench to install the screw. Tighten the screw until it's snug, but not too tight. That's what the rubber gasket will help you do. And our shelf is secure. Let's do the other one. I almost forgot, there's some small caps to cover the screw holes here. So before you get the second shelf in, go ahead and pop those in. Okay, we're ready for our second shelf. Snug, but not too tight. All right, I'm gonna take off the tape, telling me where I was gonna mount this. And finally, the cap on top. It slides right into the back channel. Boom! Just like that. Two DVD shelves. I'm Robert Jones for Installer Parts. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like, 
Love to have you subscribe and come on back for more. Goodbye. Arrivederci. Tschüss. Subscribe. Videos. Dancing. Video. Dancing.